All right, what's up, everybody? This is uh, Rafael Lovato Jr. Uh, we're here at uh, me and my father's academy in Oklahoma City. Um, I wanted to say thanks to everyone who's uh, gone by and seen my blog that I just started. Um, if you haven't been there yet, it's lovatojr.com. Uh, so as promised, I said I would put up a technique for you guys uh, to check out. And uh, we're going to go ahead and do that right now. We're going to look at a triangle from the spider guard. So, you know, we're going to say if he's on his knees here and I'm playing my spider guard, I have my foot in the bicep, I have it nice and extended. It's pretty easy for me just to put my foot on this hip, elevate my hip, shoot my leg over, and bring him in for the triangle here, okay? But it's not too often that you're going to have a guy sitting on both of his knees. More, more than likely, he's going to have one knee up because he realizes the danger here. He wants to keep that in the middle. That way I can't lock up the triangle, all right? So I'm going to be here, same thing. I have my leg extended, foot in the bicep, strong grips here. I'm going to scoop my hip away just a bit to where I can fit my other leg, that shin in front of his shin, okay? So my leg is hooking his bottom part of his leg, almost like a butterfly guard hook. Now, here, when I feel that he's driving that, that knee forward and I have it hooked, all I'm going to do is extend my leg and make his knee set down. Now that's going to open up all the space for me to shoot back over, lock that triangle up. From here, I like to keep control of this sleeve. That way I know he can't get his elbow back in front and, and relieve the pressure. So I keep control of the sleeve, grab my shin, cinch it up for the finish. So one more time. I'm going to be here. I'm playing my spider guard here. He's got that knee in the middle. I realize it. I want to look for the triangle, but i got to get rid of it. So I'm going to scoop my hip back circle my foot in front. Now I have that, that hook here, I like to call it the shin hook. I'm just going to extend my leg, make his knee fall down to the mat, then I shoot over, straight to the triangle, and there's your finish. So I hope you guys enjoy that technique, give it a try, um, and like I said, check out LovatoJr.com if you haven't been there yet, and uh, I'll talk to you guys next time. Take care.